This is how my first page usually looks like. There are a lot of writings, a lot of codes, a lot of notes as well. Do you agree that failures are never wasted? my sketchbook you know, to create a lot of artwork for projects and here you can see the artwork created for Chihul in Bloom and was used on a tipping carrier. one of my favorite corner in Chinatown. It's a long temple street and I really like this corner shop house. This is a favorite quote from Wu Guan Zhong. Search for yourself, seek within yourself. It is not easy to find yourself. So every time we sketch and we paint, we are getting to know ourselves better. We're encountering ourselves. It's also a form of searching, searching for what is next. and I brought them out to do some visual journaling on location. Brainstorming with my sketchbook, this is a page that I use to um, put down ideas so that I can discuss it with Sumita. Also, I have you know some thumbnails about upcoming projects. Coffee shop sketches, always fun. colors or many colors. Um, this year I had to do a few virtual traveling as well as, you know, because of COVID. And on this page you can see my uh, sketch after taking my first jab of the COVID vaccine, waiting for 30 minutes before I can leave. More traveling to Italy.
here I was doing some brush uh, testing and these are some of my favourite brushes uh, from Rosemary and Da Vinci they are all Kolinsky Sable round brushes This year I also got myself um, new dip pens and ink and here I was learning about dip pens and how to really use them for sketching on location. A bit messy but really fun. This sketchbook is special because it is handmade by a fellow urban sketcher, Lynette Look, and she's covered with you know really interesting fabric as well. And the paper used is Fabriano Hot Press. In April, we had another round of heightened alerts, so we had to stay home most of the time because of uh, restrictions. So uh, we were traveling to Japan virtually on our weekends. And here we did another virtual travel to Japan. And we did this mostly over Zoom with a few uh, Urban Sketcher friends. I really look forward to our weekend Zoom virtual travel sessions together. And this is the accordion sketchbook made by Lynette. And still drawn to travel, here's my virtual travel trip to Italy with some friends via Zoom. were finally lifted in June and we could meet up with our fellow sketching friends and draw on location again. Here I started visiting cafes and hanging out with my friends. Here I'm brainstorming a new artwork with collage, cut up shapes, coloured shapes as well. It's a really fun way to just you know get out of the box. I wish I was in Amsterdam and Cuba 
but unfortunately no uh, we had to do virtual traveling again because of a surge in COVID cases here Excited to get this new Schmincker super granulating set. This is the Tundra set, and you can see the five beautiful colors. It's always fun to sketch and hang out with Liz and we used to do it regularly at the symposiums but now you know we have to do it via Zoom and you know it's always nice to hear what she's up to and we did this sketch together over an hour of chatting and sketching. fun brainstorming with Suita as we prepare for another new sketching clay lab session and this one is all about using dry media. These few pages are all about playing, experimenting, and think about new ideas for my next sketch.
decided to go back to a smaller sketchbook. This is a smaller accordion sketchbook, very portable and very light. And because it's small, you know, I tend to draw faster and just keep it simple. This is a page from my outing to the Fort Canning Park. I really enjoy the day out, sketching nature and just sketching big, wide open green spaces. I like using the accordion sketchbook because, you know, I can stretch it out and see how one sketch flows into the other. And also it shows the passing of time and how one story can lead me to another. This is my last sketchbook of 2021. Another favourite quote from Mary Oliver, to pay attention, this is our endless and proper work. What do you think? sketchbook. I hope you also will find time to look back at your sketchbook and what happened this year. 